Hi, I'm Bora Çelebi from Yeditepe University Department of Cognitive Sciences. I'm going to present you today our study named The Effect of Surface and Underlying Material on Applied Force and Hard Disk Discrimination. Haptic perception has been a crucial aspect of scientific investigations about the human capability to assess the object properties they are presented with through the touch. Two different types of inputs have been known to be affecting this perception. The first one being the cutaneous inputs that are gathered by the meconoreceptors and thermoreceptors on the human skin, and the second one being kinesthetic inputs that are gathered by receptors on tendons and muscles. Here we believe that, in a hardness softness discrimination task, applied force would be affected by the base material and the change of surfaces on these materials. Moreover, Estimation of the magnitude of the force would be affected by these, concluding that through the strategy of applying force on the object with fingers, people are successful at discriminating hardness and softness of the objects. As for our method, 30 participants were present in the experiment. Eight different objects were given to the participants. All objects were variations of the two objects that are a wood brick and a sponge, used as a base material. Their surface materials varied between velvet, artificial grass, scarring pad, and no surface material. Objects were chosen according to the rating done by Hollings et al. at 1993. The thickness of the surface materials were between 2 to 3 millimeters in order to eliminate the compliance and deformation effect. We measured the applied forces on objects through two load cells pinned to a stable surface and gathered the data by converting it to the digital by an ADC and transferred it through the serial port to a PC. We asked participants to rate their applied force and the softness and hardness of the objects through the scale of 1 to 9. For our results, we performed a MANOVA analysis with applied force, perceived applied force, duration, and perceived hardness as dependent variables, and base material along with surface material as independent variables. Multivariate tests show that there is a significant interaction between base material and all dependent variables and between surface material and dependent variables. Pairwise tests show that applied force, perceived applied force, duration and perceived hardness is significantly different across different base materials. However, only perceived applied force and duration were significantly different across different surface materials. Also, it was resulted that participants tended to use multiple touches and change of applied forces through exploration process. To discuss further, we found out that applied force and the estimation of the force applied on the objects differ according to the hardness and softness of the object. Thus, we concluded that as a strategy to assess the hardness and softness property of the object, participants changed their applied force. And assessment of the force they applied was also a prominent factor on the discrimination task that may mean that people are partially aware of the magnitude of the force they conducted on a surface. The surface material change had not a significant effect on applied force, but that had an interaction with perceived force. That means that people were aware that they applied different magnitudes of force on different surface materials, given that the base material is not changed. Also, participants were using the strategy of differentiating duration on their exploration in a hardness softness discrimination task. Therefore, our study concluded that people were able to use different strategies, most importantly, the force they applied on the objects in order to assess the hardness softness discrimination. Future research would provide with the ratio between hardness and applied force and also the duration needed to assess the softness and hardness of the objects. Thank you for listening. If you have any questions, you can feel free to ask.